What's up, Shark Bite Pirates? I'm back and I'm ready for OPO8. This is the set that we've been looking forward to. I know we're chasing that Marco, but I've been seeing some great builds with Pudding and King. So let's get right into it. Also, I will be announcing the winner of both the treasure, uh, or not treasure, the best PRB. But since I did mention the treasures, make sure you're subscribed and like and comment below what your favorite set has been so far. Cause you could win one of these treasure boosters if it wants to, if it wants to load. But let's get right into it. Man, I'm excited to be back guys. We have two One Piece OPOAs. We're gonna start with the left side. Hopefully I don't mess that up. Uh, okay. All right, that that took longer lo longer than it should have been. Uh, but yeah, I'm back, guys. I'm excited. I had not. I wasn't able to go to any pre-releases, so now I'm just living in my sorrows, opening OPO8 and some treasure boosters. Like I said, if you want to be entered to win one of these, one of these, make sure you uh, are subscribed, like this video, and comment below what set you've liked so far. I know a lot of these have both. I've been seeing a lot of people get massive pulls, man. Uh, they have either had OPO 1, 3, 4, and 5, or you get OPO 2 instead of 1. Um, hopefully, we're going we're gonna to be opening some soon. I did get an extra box and because you can still get them at Walmart or Target if you check their website. I think Hot Topic might have some but I'm excited to be back with you guys and hopefully, hopefully open a bunch more. <laughs> we're, we're excited, man. I did just get back from Japan. It has been, it's been fun. Um, I didn't miss you guys. I didn't miss opening stuff. I know if you were stay tuned to my Instagram, you saw a couple pictures. I am going to be uploading a couple more things about it and like little short videos that I was able to work on. Uh, this Minx card though, this Minx card is really good. Who's, who's running Carrot? Who, for OPO8, who's running Carrot? I, we had a lot of actual good leaders this time around, uh, that I'm excited to see. Like, Kalgara, I've been seeing some really good movement. They were taking it to off metas, apparently, because it hasn't won anything major yet. Oof. I'm, Marco, Marco the Phoenix, guys. I already bought my sleeves for Marco. That's one thing that I've done a lot throughout Japan. Uh, not, not the king we're looking for. Not the king we're looking for. Perfect. I actually did want both of these cards. This king, man, once you get to 10 Don and you have the Albert, I think his name is. It's the other king card, the four cost. Sets you up perfectly, bro. Sets you up perfectly. I know in this set, I am looking for a lot of the SRs. I need a play set of like the Namis, the Bonnie, the Carrots. I don't know. I mean, she she's good for for Bonnie, so I do I do want her. Um, she's like a small version of the Flamingo, just a different variety of it. So that's actually a really good S snake, which is good for my uh, blue yellow Ace that I'm looking forward to. So yeah, we got S snake. I am gonna be replacing Bo uh, Boa. For blue yellow lace with that five cost that's way that way it's easier for me not to whiff uh especially with blue aces effect where you have to add two dawn and then look at top five put a five cost up on your life that's gonna make it a little easier because i kept whiffing with boa made it tough made it merit made it tougher than it should have been that's for sure uh, i am looking forward to more Oof, do we Charlotte Linlin, <laughs> shout out to my retro. He just pulled the altar like four times for no reason. <laughs> the the altars in this set, man, have been exciting. Oof, I think we have another another SR. Uh, the altars in the set have been really cool. I know I want the Ace for my collection. The SP as well. The SP Ace or for the seven cost looks crazy. The Gecko Moria four cost from the starter deck. What else is in this one? Is Bonnie in this one? I think Bonnie's SP, the searcher, is in this one as well. It is Albert. It is Albert. Activate main. You may trash this character if your leader has the Animal Kingdom Pirates type. You and you have 10 Dawn cards on your field. Play up to one king with a cost of seven or less from your hand. There's so many different kings right now, variation-wise. 
that you can do jack jack is crazy guys jack is gonna be a beast for most of these black decks especially like corona obviously luchi's gonna work out and if you're doing the black starter deck luffy which unfortunately i was trying to film a video with the starter decks or at least uh, going over them did not work out i think all the footage was gone or it was just straight up corrupt so I was very disappointed on the plane to Japan and I couldn't really edit anything on there. So that's why we didn't have any two week videos in the last two weeks, which was very, very tough. And so I wanted to, to have something set. Oof, guys, I think we have something. Unless it's, no, no, it is not. It is not, we, we got something. We got something. It's good to have the disappointment camera back, man. Look at that, the view, oof. Is that black? Uh, what? The altar jack, maybe? Maybe? What else has black? Oh, wait a minute. The first time stage event that's hollow, guys. Really, really got me on that one. <laughs> womp, 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 womp. All right, all right. Disappointment is perfect. It still still has its name. It's working out just like we wanted. <laughs> uh, I saw crazy builds. Now I see the Drum Kingdom card. I saw crazy builds with the Zoro and Animal Kingdom group. I think they're calling it like Zoro, which is hilarious. I think a lot of people are gonna be building that deck just because it it's a, I mean, Hiking Bear too. It's such a hyped up set. Oof, wait. I mean, shout out to Lexi. She loves all the chopper cards, man. Lexi's one of our subscribers here too. So, oof, ah. Uh, I don't remember what the Dawn is for this one actually. Uh, but yeah, shout out to Lexi. She's one of our like biggest supporters of the channel and our Instagram and everything. Um, she's a huge chopper fan. I saw that she's collecting every chopper she can, which is just epic. Hey, we need we need one liter of everything. Charlotte Pudding is perfect, dude. I don't know. I'm thinking the altar is gorgeous. The art on the altar is gorgeous, and we have Queen Searcher, and it is the white beard. I mean, he, he's looking yoked though. I actually want the white beard Dawn cards from the double packs. The double pack white beer cards or Don cards look crazy. I'm I'm really excited for that one. Um, and so is the Rayleigh. The Rayleigh one is really nice too. I want to see what um what the PRB Dons are gonna be for those for those guys. If we ever even get a Rayleigh. All right, so at least we have one Marco that we can start using. It's a perfect build up for our deck. And then there's King and then Wapple, which I was thinking of doing for Sanji PRB leader. That's that's gonna be wild. Yeah, PRB getting one leader. Oof, do we have anything in this one? Or just an SR? Might be just an SR. Guys, we've been getting a lot of uh, SR hits in this box. I think there's only seven per box, if I'm not mistaken. And we're, we're getting them all on this right side. On this right side. Usually, right is right, which, hey, it's, it's working out perfectly. <laughs> okay, that, that means this right side, the left side is gonna be full of banger. Oof, is that a banger right there? Maybe, maybe. Also guys, while I have you here, I wanted to tell you guys about our one of our sponsors, Binders. I'm working with them now. It's gonna be pretty epic. They have a bunch of binders set up. You should see carrots. <laughs> you should see in the description below our uh, link for you to pick up and get 15% off your first order. They have a really good set. Ooh. They have a really good, cool set coming up that I want to show you guys. Uh, we're going to be doing a giveaway with them soon, so just be on the lookout for that. But until then, let's get right into the disappointment camera because I did see something. I did see some kind of color in the back. Oof. S-Night, shout out to all my eggheads and three, two. 
and we got the altar jack <laughs> right on guys this dude this card if you've been playing the sim you are no you hated this card all the black decks playing this right now is perfect because you get to ko anything with three costs or less man bro the art art is crazy i want to know what you guys are chasing in this set right now i know the treasure rare treasure rare is definitely wait I'm not gonna waste your time. I'm not gonna, we have another box to go through. We ain't got the time. <laughs> I know the treasure rare Luffy looks incredible. It's definitely one of my chase cards, uh, especially cause I wanted to collect all the treasure rares anyway. Ooh, there's something shiny there. Ooh. We, we, we all know how this set goes with us. Last time we saw something shiny and we thought it was an SR, it was the Japanese Ray, Silver Rayleigh manga. Can we do it again this time around in English? I feel like that's gonna be icing on the cake if I can get, if I can get Kaido. If I can just get Kaido. Oh, that's okay, that's okay. We got one altar with the Jack. We have maybe hopefully one more, maybe two more. Uh, oof, that was an ugly rip. I did see shine, but I could, I could totally be wrong, guys. I could totally be wrong. But yeah, I want to see what you guys are going to be building. I know... I know that was hard. I know there's a couple builds that I really want to work on. Like the... The King one and Chopper. No, I don't, I don't think I want to build Chopper. But it's a really cool card, especially all the other Choppers that are coming along with him. The, the build for any of the beasts... Or minx? No, I think it's beast, right? Oh, it's any of the animal builds are going to be great. Uh, the the idea of just flooding the board is pretty pretty crazy, man. I saw I played against a couple ones on the sim when they built the Zuro 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 Zuro. I just want to call it Zuro, just like the Pokemon, but it's not the same. I hey wait oh. This is I need I need the the OPO three Katakuri man I need I just don't want to shell out twenty five or thirty bucks or whatever it's going for right now just for the SEC when we know PRB is right around the corner and it's coming in at least once in a box like with PRB you have who do you have you have Shanks Katakuri Kuzan and Yamato I think are the SECs. That you'll, you'll be able to pull so why not just wait it out uh i think by then i'll probably be playing i'll play it now if i do get it or maybe i will jump to purple yellow pudding for fun for funsies <laughs> it's it's a good build kagara is also a really good build with flooding the board it's pretty pretty annoying uh to play against sometimes Ooh, do we have something guys do we have something? Ah, it's the SEC. <laughs> the Altar SEC is fire. I love the design on it. But this is also, this is a good one. This is good. It's, it's all right, guys. We have three more packs out of this box. It's funny because I've been dying to open OPOA English. It's obviously Marco's the, the build that I'm going for. But just to be able to get new cards to play with. Who, who can turn that option down? I think it's pretty exciting to see new card builds, especially now with the game going as far as it's going. The SEC is, is still an epic card. I think I would use it instead of using the 10 cost Kaido. Uh, I think the 10 cost Kaido is from OPO1. You know I'm gonna put the picture. You know you know I'm gonna put the picture. It's the purple deck. I want to build Kaido. I So I was talking to my friends about it and I was like, you know what? I want a purple deck. I, I most likely will have Luffy in OPO9. I think OPO9 is going to definitely set the bar high. Wanda. The OPO9 is going to set the bar high and really, really test you with your leader, leader picks. Uh, so I definitely, I definitely am going to be changing most likely to have a purple black Luffy deck. I was debating on working on one soon, just at least with the purple deck. But I might wait until the starter deck, which is like starter decks are really going to push the next set of cards going forward. Oof. 
I think I think we've gotten every leader at this point. And this is the last pack of This is the last pack of this box. Can we hit again? Oof. Mm, this might just be I think I think it's the yeah, yeah. I'm not even gonna It's the 10 cost Edward Newgate. I don't know if I want to add this into Marco. Um People are telling me to add it into the blue yellow ace, but like for that, I'd rather just have ace, the yellow tent cost one, you know? Okay, let's go on to the second box. Actually, funny enough, uh, this is the third box because when I was starting to film the second box, um, don't know what happened. Don't know what the freak happened. So to show you what I got from the second box because I don't have it is these two cards. <laughs> I actually got the treasure red Luffy and the Kaido and Lin Lin uh, from that second box, which was the best, the best to be honest. Cause I really wanted this card. It looks beautiful. I want a playset. I actually want a whole playset. So for that mistake for OBS crashing or the camera not going through, I'm opening another box to make myself feel better. So here we go. Let's get into this second recorded box. Um, it's a mess in here now. It's it's a total mess in here. The camera for some reason is being weird, uh, malfunctioning, I guess. So it didn't record the second box, and now we get to open a third box for fun, for funsies. Which is okay, which is okay because we, we enjoy opening anyway. Um, and I didn't get to open anything for pre-release, so we're just making it up as we go. We're making it up as we go along. This is, this is good. Everything is good. I do not remember, I do not remember what <laughs> I was talking about when I was opening the second box, but I was talking to myself. And now we have the other Jack. Now we have a place that a Jack. Hopefully I wonder if that is the place that with the altar or without the altar. Cause now I don't recall, but that is okay. That is okay. <laughs> we have a couple, I mean, shout out to the Vega punk guys, man. There's so much support this time around now that I do not, I would not be surprised if I see Vega Punk topping like top 16. I think Vega Punk is a really, oof, wait a second. Oh no, it's just Bonnie. Fi hey, we finally got a Bonnie. I don't think I've seen her at all this whole time. And this is gonna be a good, good, good yellow card either for an L or even yellow red Sabo. Red yellow Sabo is also a good, I don't know why I'm like, trying to make decks work i really like blue yellow ace that's like my biggest um please work out please work out kind of deck uh it, it does well it does well it's very competitive right now my main decks are blue dolphy i have a gecko that i've been working on that uh i am going to a treasure cup this weekend i believe since it's i think i've only been able to play in one of the treasure cup this year or this season or this month because the other ones were right before the other one was right before vacation the other ones were during the vacation which again also wait a second let's let's run through also i am going to be putting the winners of these two prb sets in the description so make sure you stay tuned to that and don't forget to hit that subscribe button and comment below what your favorite set from one through five has been so that you can be entered into these treasure rare which actually are pretty cool i've been seeing a lot of people pull mangas too pretty cool i've been seeing a lot of people pull mangas too so that's actually very very fun i think that that in the combination with prb coming hopefully before november or maybe in november it's really gonna make the game a little more affordable i saw a lot of prices go down i saw kid the eight cost drop from like 30 something dollars 
to 15. I think 15 is pretty solid to pick up a single a single card right now. So if you haven't done so yet, either you can pick it up now or just wait till PRB hits that reprint. The reprint is going to help out a lot, especially with like Katakuri, which I think is way overpriced right now. It's a great card. It's a really good card, but I do not want to pay. I don't know what it was at that point, like 35 to 60 bucks for a regular SEC as well. Is it really, is it really worth it? I don't think so, <laughs> but there are a couple really good, really small the Flamingo right here. There's a couple really good cards coming in PRB reprint wise that are going to be easier for everyone to oof. I, I saw that. I saw that and I knew Pedro's really cool too. Pedro's the on KO choose one rest up to one of your opponent's Dawn cards or KO up to one of your opponent's rest of character with a cost of six, which is which, which is huge guys, which is huge, especially for most of these. I mean, for Minx alone, it's it's really good. It's going to be really good for care. Oof. Guys, I think we have something not a leader yet, not a leader, but we do we we do have something. We do have something, <laughs> hopefully, because the other one I thought was a zoo. It was just, just the, the stage card, the only hollow stage card that I've ever seen. But we have something. Oh, you got to be kidding me. I am so sorry. I am so sorry. <laughs> I, as I was talking about it, it, it showed up. It showed up. So maybe we can get a Marco, Marco leader, Marco leader, Marco leader. I don't think we've gotten any hits in this box yet. So this, this left side, this right side is going to be spectacular. It's going to be spectacular. Hopefully in the next, oh, a snake altar. This is actually super nice. I mean, the, 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 uh, yeah, the Bonnie and the Nami ones, these waifu cards look crazy, but this art looks so nice. Okay, so we got our first hit. Uh, the S snake is is beautiful. The artwork on that is crazy. Uh, I like I said, I wanted to add it to blue, yellow, A's, so it works out a lot. I think I'm only gonna run maybe two anyway. So if we can get the other alt art, that would be pretty cool. That would be pretty cool. I think it's such a really nice. Uh, the pink on it is just really nice. The artwork on it is just pretty crazy i do like dr korea as a searcher um uh, oh wait there's still one part one more pack on the left side i don't know miss out on that one uh <laughs> it does it does work really well with dr korea just as a searcher it makes things a little easier but yeah i think i was talking about katakuri i'm i'm all over the place but <laughs> a katakuri i do not I thought I saw it. I thought I saw it. I'm kind of a little opposed to paying that much for an SEC. Uh, even when it was Ace, when it was Yellow Ace, I thought it was way too much to be paying for when it was around 40 bucks. I mean, the alt art, I don't know where the alt art price wise now is, but it's still a really good card. And it's, it's extremely playable for a lot of these yellow decks. And now it has it, uh, Blue Yellow Ace is running it. I think no i've seen some decks with blue yellow or yellow red sabo have it but not black yellow luffy not black yellow luffy how many people are playing black yellow luffy i actually really do like that deck a lot i think it's a really good deck especially uh with the gecko moria some people say the deck list isn't complete but that that deck really runs perfectly with the system it has. I think Thunderbolt is really good for it. And then, uh, what's this other call? Oh, Ice Age, Ice Age. I really want the Altar Ice Age as well from, that has Kuzon in it. I'm telling you, we once we get a Kuzon leader, bro, it's, it's over. I'm pretty sure Kuzon should be blue. Now that I thought about it, it should be blue, black, especially with the Blackbeard Pirate cards for 09. Blue, black, Kuzon would be really good. I did think purple and black would be really nice, um, but not, it's not gonna have the, enough support. 
it won't have enough support so we should have the blue navy package and the black pack, black package and with the black beard pirates very solid playable cars in 08 i think the only other set that had really good srs was like eb01 cavendish is super good and the price went up the the chopper is really good what else came out in eb oh kid and killer which is just a, a rare i think at that time not even an sr flan pay was really good i think is viola in that one i think viola is in that set and that was really good <laughs> guys we have one silver rayleigh i beautiful card this artwork is the altar which is amazing but the actual card it's super playable it's perfect for any red decks and i did need four to combo it with sanji so maybe i'll open some opo6 soon hmm. Hmm. very very nice nice box i mean it made it made up for the other one it made up for the other one that we just lost uh, so it, it, it's working out guys it's working out we're doing great so far so we just gotta just gotta keep it up <laughs> just keep it up maybe there's a third uh like maybe there's a leader uh maybe there's a third hit maybe we will get that not care not not care guys not please don't give me care that's she's not a bad leader she's a good leader i just do not my heart just sank because the camera clicked off again and i looked again and it was like saying i thought i said start recording and i almost died i you almost well you know you wouldn't have witnessed me die because the camera wasn't wouldn't have been filming if it was recording but i almost passed out just now so Calgara. all right we have five packs left which is pretty pretty cool i think we've done so oof oh so dang i just showed it that's cool. We, we got Onami. I think we got the play set now. That was, that was rough. That was rough. I was like, ooh, there's something there. We The set has been notorious for playing us out. Um, so far, at least with the, the Japanese, I, I thought we were getting it. I thought we were getting it. We did get it. It was perfect time. I think that was one of my favorite videos. I, uh, I think that was my first manga pull on on camera too which was iconic and it's okay it's okay we are here for more uh i might i might consider going live one of these days as well just to be able to hang out with you guys just to open packs and talk about the game i, I really would like to set that up soon i don't know what time best works for everyone I am on the East Coast, so Eastern obviously is going to be the ideal situation. And oh, I don't even have to look. I already know. And it's King Sasaki and White Beard. All right, this is the last pack, Magic. Hopefully, hopefully, do you have some next one? But if you guys, if you enjoyed the video, hit that like button. Make sure you're subscribed to be entered into that treasure booster giveaway. <laughs> it's such a long term and hopefully, hope I'll catch you guys on the next episode or on one of these on this side. I'll see you later.